this is going to be a hard book for you to promote because when you go on a lot of these talk shows, what you're talking about is a topic that is really, you did a lot of soul searching. You know, you're talking about your brother's death. You're talking about all of a sudden realizing that you've been infantilizing yourself. I mean, there's not a lot of places to go where people are really going to get it, right? No, it's funny. It's all, it's always, I mean, they're going to get it. They're getting it. It's that people are getting it. Right. And I'm doing this tour. Like I didn't write a book for five years because I didn't have anything to say. And I now have something to say and I want, and this is important. Like it wasn't important just for me to do the work. As I was writing, this is the first time I wrote a book without a paycheck. Like I just wrote it because I was like, this is worthwhile. How long did it take you to write it? Like eight months. Eight months. Yeah. Now, how do you do it? You sit down and you just say, I'm writing a book. And then every day for like eight hours, you sit there and write. No, no, of course not. I'm not that disciplined. But how many I, revisions? Oh, lots. I mean, my editor, Julie Grau, who is with me right here today, she said, I know you have something in you deep. Right. And why don't you figure out what that is and get back to me? And I was like, huh, I thought that when I did my last book five years ago that I had something to say, but I didn't know I couldn't pinpoint it. And it's been percolating and percolating. And when I met with the psychiatrist and I started writing our sessions down and they were, you know, it's ridiculous to try and get better at life when you're constantly fucking up. You're trying to meditate, you're working with your therapist, and then you get in a fight with a parking lot attendant, you know, two minutes later, calling him a fucking asshole. And you feel like you've gone 10 steps backwards. You're like, wait, I just, I'm trying so hard to be better. Why can't I get this right? And that's what therapy is, is getting better a little step at a time and that you're never going to be, you know, you're never done as a person, but there is room for huge improvement. 